Is so much really yes, the yes. tale that you humans have passed down through the unannounced gener and counted generations. This is Fee talking, by the way. You're Fee. Tells a warrior my curiosity. Oh, yeah, I should turn my volume up because I can't hear Jack's head. Yeah. <laughs> it's one dark faithful day. Like the earth cracks wide and malevolent forces rush okay. forth from the fissure. I forgot I was on a 1% since so unspoken. Okay. <laughs> this entire fucking time I was like, look at your Jack's head. I can hear you, but not the they game. They mounted a brutal assault upon the surface, driving the land deep into despair. They burnt forest to ash, choked the land's sweet springs, and murdered without hesitation. They monetized with that. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. It works. The music, the music skull, okay, shut up. They did all this in their lust to take the ultimate power perfected by her grace, the goddess. Dum 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 Shit, got me to do it. Dum 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 Hey! The power she guarded was without <laughs> equal. Handed down by the gods of old. The power gave its soul the means to take it make any desire a reality. She, such was the might of the ultimate power that the old ones placed in the care of the goddess. <clears throat> to prevent this great power from falling into the hands of evil swarming. The lands, sorry. <clears throat> the goddess gathered no, surviving not. humans <laughs> on an outcropping of the earth. She sent it skyward, beyond the reach of its demonic cords, beyond even the clouds. God, the music, man! <laughs> right? With the humans safe, the goddess joined forces with the land dwellers and fought the evil forces, sealing them away. At last, peace was restored to the surface. Bleh! I'm sorry. Yeah, bleh. It looks like the creature's going, bleh! I know, right? It's, it's goofy, silly. You're goofy, silly. This is a tale that you humans have told for many ages, generation to the generation. Oh, the music. But there are other legends long hidden away from memory that are entwined with this tale. Huh. Now a new legend bound to this great story stands ready to be revealed. A legend that will be forged by your own hand. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm sorry, I just love these games. You're cute, it's okay. Can't wait for Fee to tell us that our batteries are low. Yes, she will stop you mid-game and just be like, Master, I, there's like a 100% chance that you need to change the batteries in your Wiimote. Wait, really? Yep, yeah, but I, I wonder what it's going to be like for the Switch. <laughs> well, I'll just yell at you for like, your Switch is dying, stupid. Yes! Oh. Oh, I can just reset that whenever. That's helpful. Oh. Yes, one of the controllers is acting like a... <laughs> we won't right now. That's awesome. What? I haven't had to go full Wiimote in a long time. Goodness. All right, Kimi. Do your magic. Squeaky. Squee what did I write? For Skyward Sword, Link? We have... Squeagle. Forget. S Q U E E G L E Q U E E D No, not squirrel. No. E E G L E. Do you know how stupid this name's gonna sound compared to the Oh no! Oh yeah, I forgot there's a U. There's a U between the U, the U, the the two E's. Forgot shit. Sorry. It's Q U E E G L E. Yeah. Squeagle. You're lucky that it fits. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we, have, <laughs> we have Pinkus for an orc, we have time, and now we got Squeagle for Skyward Sword. <laughs> I, prom great, I promise remember. you, that name you've chosen is going to be so stupid. Alright, let's see what happens. No, it's the best name ever, okay, shut up. And I mean that in the best way, it's stupid in the best way. Also, oh <laughs> shit. Fucking Squeagle. Oh dear. 
so cool. Nope. 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 Nah. Nah. Not my cup of tea. Right? It's scary. That, remember, that's not on we're we're on Skyloft. That's uh the surface. Yep. <coughs> I say we should go until... Like what, an hour? I'll let you know it's a good time then, honestly. Okay. When it comes to story wise for episode one at least. You know what, sure. Okay. LOFT WINGS! YEAH! It ends recording like right now, so thanks guys, that was episode one. So thank you everybody <laughs> for <imagine>. watching. <laughs> I can imagine. <laughs> you haven't even played the game yet, so get for done. <laughs> yeah. Hey, three guys so. that are assholes, but I, I shouldn't say anything. You know what? Shut up, Mick. Let, let Kimi learn who the characters yeah, are Yeah, Mickey, shut the fuck up. Yeah, exactly. Remember, you recognize Even though I already got, like, oh. way past this part. <laughs> She's singing. Zelda singing. Oh. I'll, I'll, I'll show you where I, where oh. I stopped playing this. All right. I did the classic. Oh, this one shrine or temple or puzzle or whatever pissed me off. So I'm not good time to get. <laughs> also, the music of this game is like ridiculously good. I love the art yeah, style too. I also have this game on my Switch, but yeah. I stopped playing because after a while it pissed oh. me off. I'm too stupid. Oh. Hi, Spiegel. Oh my god. Rise, Spiegel. The time has come for you to awaken. You are, you are fated to have a hand and a great destiny and will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken. <laughs> Spiegel. Oh god. <laughs> Thank you, Fee. Very cool. <laughs> Bird jump scare, bird jump scare for real. Oh. Yeah, this 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 one's a little silly funny like that. Hi bird. Stupid! I poop it's on a poop its beak. <laughs> <laughs> Rude. <laughs> oh my god. I forgot how silly this game could get. My god, this could be fun playing this one again. Hey, sleepyhead! Oh, oh, oh guess who? Sleepy. Guess who's saying that? Ooh, That's a letter Zelda? from Zelda. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was right. It's cute. <laughs> hey, sleepyhead! I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? Rise and shine, Squeagle. Today's the wing ceremony. He promised to me to be it before it starts. Remember? You better not keep me waiting, Zelda. Gotta love how they're really good friends in this one already. Oh, look at this one! That's a fucking cute rude. Okay, let's see if I remember some stuff here. <laughs> yup, we can still crack our skull open. If you haven't noticed, by the way, look how many hearts we start with. Oh, shit. Not three, six. Alright, let's get what some the cash. Hell? Better drop it in your wallet for now. Can I just mention again just how nice the art style is in this game? Kiwi? Right? I like it too. Also, Link carves and he's a carver in this game. Oh shit. He does carving, he carved a bird statue. That's cool. Go eat. I forgot about that, honestly. It'd be really funny if you just went back to eat. Okay. Alright. Uh, got a lot of tabs to be working with here. Right? But first off. Oh. I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure what that'll do, but for all means. There. Hmm. 
Okay. I think, if I'm not mistaken, Skyward's the first one to introduce, uh... Stamina Bar. What the? Yep. Alright. Yeah? Hey, Fibbit. Morning, Sweagle! So today's the wind ceremony, are you ready? All I'm saying is everyone else out there is practicing in the plaza, but you seem pretty relaxed about the whole thing. Of course, that crimson loft wing of yours is something special. I'd feel pretty confident riding him, too. My bird won the last ceremony, but I don't think he can beat that red terror of yours. Of course, if words true speed in the race always comes down to skill of the rider. I'm something of a bird researcher around here, so, you know, if you ever find yourself in need of some bird expertise, come see old Pippet. Thanks, Pippet. <laughs> You're gonna like this guy's design. This guy's got a really nice design. Look at him. Mm. Yeah. Hey, Squeagle. The day of the wing ceremony is finally upon us. It's time to put what you've learned to use. Uh, all those practical skills I taught you, and all the academic prowess instructor Horwell taught you. While we're at it, do you remember how to look around using the up button? No, I don't <laughs> know what the up button is, Sir Alan. Press up when you want to take a look at your surroundings. Alan, sir, what the fuck does that even mean? Alright. <laughs> Nerd. That's Grease's room. Yep. Love cracking our face open on stuff. I know, right? Crawling and Stitch aren't home. Fledge isn't home. Oh, there's Fledge. Good morning, Squeagle. Today's the big wing ceremony, right? Well, I wanted to fly, too, but I, I didn't make the cut, so I'm stuck back here at the academy. Plus, I oh gotta move these barrels over to the kitchen. I was hoping to at least be able to cheer you on, Squeagle, but I guess the way it goes now. Go out there and wow them, buddy. What were you gonna say, Kiwi? I was gonna say, I just now realized that, like, all these people are, are named after verbs. <laughs> I didn't know that. Kind of. Fledge, like fledgling. Owl then. Owl. Oh, I get it. Goose, goose. Goose. Yep. Oh my God! Why didn't I realize that this entire? Oh my God. I know, right? It took me only until now to finally realize. I'm like, wait a fucking sec. <laughs> Hen. Yeah. Yep. Dumb, dumb bird bone. Come on. Quit. Why in the cloud just that fledge boy? <laughs> He's supposed to be bringing me barrels. Sometimes I just don't know what's going on in that boy's head. Let's go help her out. Maybe Listen, we can. How long has this big game been out? <laughs> we only just oh God. <laughs> Typical bungle dungle. <laughs> Typical bungle dungle moment. Angry! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so that stamina bar is looking a little. I got, I got, I got, I got. <laughs> Miss Henya, there's your barrels. Yep. <laughs> Notice how we didn't get a quest marker or anything this? to do that? I know, right? We were okay, just. I thought I was to carry that. It's probably for the best. That skinny boy would have probably gotten himself flat. Say, don't you have some important business ceremony or some such thing? Huh. Well, thanks for the help. I like how we're helping. It looks, listen, we didn't even have to. Yep. yep. Now let's piss her off. Uh oh. Yep. <laughs> uh oh. Aw. Aw, she doesn't care. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, I'm make too much of a mess because they ain't get you, I'm guessing. <laughs> Probably! Let's find out! Nah. Uh, nah, she doesn't care. Well, it's ceremony time. Let's go to the bedroom. <laughs> yeah? I love how happy the music is, by the way. Right? 
Happy music. Link took a fat shit. Anyways. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Let's get out there to our ceremony. Yep. Look at Skyloft. Diddy. What a beautiful music to go along with it too. Recognize the goddess statue, by the way, the design. Yep. Hmm. You know. Hi. Hi, Elia. Oh, Link can really run around too. That's right. He yeah. ain't no slouch in this game. Burb. <laughs> there we go. Watch how fast Link can sprint. Hey! Oh. Hey. <laughs> oh, I don't know what kind of bird that is, but. Hello? Hey, Squiggle up here. Hey, Squiggle Maybe? up here! Yo! Good morning to you, Squeagle. Today's finally the day of the long-awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered there's something I'd like to ask you about. Target me so we can have a quick chat. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> Alright. Excellent. Always remember you can target someone to talk to them easy. And even when there isn't anything to target, it's a convenient way to face your view forward, which I do a lot. Oh, it's a little silly to carry on the conversations from a distance. Just come join me up here. You should be able to climb up if you dash to the top of that wooden box, don't you think? Then you can make that jump fairly easily. Try climbing up here. Mobility! Hell yeah. There we go. Yo. So what are you up to, rushing to get the lab last minute bird riding practice in this morning, Sweagle? Oh? You have someone to meet. Ah, Zelda is waiting for you, is she? <laughs> Perfect timing, then. You see, Zelda's father, Headmaster Kepora, has a pet named Mia, and, well, she's scampered off again. God damn it. <laughs> Look! Over there! Do you see her? The Headmaster's so busy working with Zelda, preparing for the ceremony, that I thought maybe I should feed her. <sighs> but the ceremony is about to start, and I just put on a fresh set of clothes, and, well, you see... Will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? I'm on it. Ooh. Fantastic! So you'll do it! I know you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate your taking the time to help. Uh. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there if you hang off that ledge. You could climb onto the roof from the other side. I'm, I'm terribly sorry, but I know you're quite the climber. I really do appreciate it. Yeah, no! That's a fucking understatement! Wait until the Breath of the Wild happens! <laughs> For real. Link, Link, you like to climb. Yeah. <laughs> do, do, do. Music is so nice in this game. Ah, I always love it. Come on, Link. There you go. You mean Squeagle? Squeagle, thank you. Calling the wrong name. That's gonna be fun to remember. Kitty cat. Oi. Why are you calling him Vinkus by accident? Did you hear it squeak? Yes, it's a squeaky head. Aw. Look at the joy on Link's face. Hey? Adorable. Joy! Aw, aw, the little, the little, the little kikis. <laughs> Stop, that's cute. This is a little squeakies! So cute. <laughs> Link picks up animals in this game. Horrible. <laughs> Little meow meow kitty. Aww. <laughs> Oops. Ooh. Nice work! You've brought her back safe and sound! Sorry for troubling you with this. I, I know you're busy, Squeagle. I suppose I should feed Mia now. <clears throat> Please tell the headmaster that we found his pet. He should be up by the statue of the goddess. That's fine by me! Oh, whoops. Oh, yes, I uh -huh. should give you a reward. It's not much, but please take this. And, uh, don't tell the others. <laughs> Damn! Just 20 bucks? Just for that? Hey. <laughs> Shit, I'd be doing stuff like that all day if I'm at 20 bucks a piece. For real. Well, did you see its head tilt? <laughs> it has big ol' ears. Adorable.
Little is little is. Hi. It's a little awkward without the wee the wee, wee bar. I'm not gonna lie. That's okay. Yeah. I'll get used to it. Hell yeah. Oh. You got a stamina fruit. Peculiar fruit replenishes your stamina gauge. So you just run over it, it fixes it. Oh! Yep. Lord and Squeagle, how's life? Did you manage to even get a wink of sleep last night? Figured it might be Tasha to turn and all night thinking about the ceremony today. What am I doing? Ah, just fixing this gate here. It's been squeaky lately and we can't have that on the day of the ceremony. Hey, you haven't already forgotten to send your prayers to the goddess this morning, have you? Just face the bird statue over there and say a short parrot to save your progress. As you know, those bird statues are all over Skyloft. It's about time you get in the habit of stomping at the statue every time you're on by one. <laughs> Prayer in time saves nine, if you know what I'm saying. Clever. Yeah. Clever. <laughs> Damn, Link, slow down! <laughs> Alright. No, just kidding, run faster. <laughs> oh! Bird. Burb. Burb. <laughs> Hi, Zelda. Pretty head. <laughs> oh! <laughs> that was cute! Fuck you! <laughs> So sweethearted. Aww. <laughs> hey, good morning, Spiegel. Look at them! Look at <laughs> I'm glad to see my laugh when God got you out of bed. I was pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. <laughs> but look at this instrument. Look at this outfit. They're mine to use today in the ceremony, since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Link is so happy! <laughs> Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me it's just like the one the goddess was said to have in Legends. It sounds gorgeous too. I asked father about it. He says it's called a harp. <laughs> <laughs> and look at these gloves. I made this wrap myself and we get to use it in today's ceremony. Between the harp and this outfit, I'm going to make a real great goddess today. Adorable. I got you up early this morning because I wanted you to be the first to see me like the Squeagle. See how fucking sweet they are! It's not even funny in this one! They're adorable! Right? They're cute. <laughs> so, how do I look? Great. Uh-huh. <laughs> Rude. <laughs> I think so too, but it's nice to know you agree. Thanks, Squeagle. Look at her! <laughs> right? <laughs> ah. There you oh. are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for today's ceremony? Oh, hello, Father. Ah, oh, Squeagle, you're here too. Outstanding. It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. Oh no, sleep! Link's a sleepyhead in this universe. Ah, like he's me. An <laughs> he's, he's an Eviehead. Eviehead for life. No we doubt. Him, we should have named him Mick. Nick. We should have named him uh, Mickey instead. Then. No. Today's yeah. ceremony had you too excited <laughs> to close your eyes for once. Mm. And if you win today's ceremonial race, you'll get to participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda. Give it your best out there. Oh. Aw. Uh. Oh. Uh, yes, about that. Uh. Father, I don't know if he can do it. But oh, look at him. He's like, what? <laughs> Recently, Squeal hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. And even when he's not riding his little wing, he's just lazily gliding around, probably dating. She wants him to win, that's the funny part. Oh, I don't know what he's thinking. He's going to have to be in perfect control of his bird to win, did he? Mm. <laughs> no need to worry yourself, Zelda. <laughs> he's just like, oh, I'm being called out. I know, right? Though you may have a I point, know. today's wing ceremony tests the skill of the rider as well as his bond with his bird. Victory will not come easy. And as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you've known him since you were both very little, so you should know better than the friend about him. 
You see, uh -oh. Squeakle and his Lufflings bear a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. Oh, shit. <clears throat> As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our loft wings, the guardian birds that the goddess bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her battalion protection. When we are young, every one of us meets our loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. It is quite a big moment, as I'm sure you recall. Ah, oh, but that first meeting between Sweagle and his loft wing was extraordinary. The bird that came to him was a crimson loft wing. It is a breed so rare that we were for sure that some time that had vanished from the line. Shit. Has an extinct bird, basically, as his bird. What the hell? And the boy and his bird seem to share a profound connection from the very moment they met. Aw. Aw, look at him. He's sorry. Aw. Do you recall when Squeagle and that loft wing of his first met? What a sight. Little boy just hopped on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. And judging by how jealous we were that day, I'd say the friendship he shared with this bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. Aww. I love how he's just calling out his daughter about that. He's reminiscing about it, too. He's like, yeah, that was a good time. Right. Now he's like, wait a minute. I think he's realizing something's wrong. Have you seen it at yeah. all in the sky? Who can blame no, you? I have not. Are you sure you're not the only one envious of that powerful bond shared by Squeagle and his bird? Anyone who's part of something special is bound to catch a nasty look sooner or later. <laughs> this god is about to laugh at father. The ceremony is part of the final test for those trainings to become knights of Skyline. I like how he's just like, easy, easy, calm down. Right, all right. All right. <coughs> If Squiggle doesn't fly fast enough during the race... What if Squiggle messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? She's rooting for him so bad! Oh, you know what? Wait, I got a wrong oh. PNG's up. Hold on. <coughs> we gotta go with our, um... There we go, fantasy ones. Perfect. Oh yeah, that's right. <coughs> there we are. Oh. Calm down, my dear. It will be fine! Honestly, it's almost as though you become a completely distant person when you worry about Squiggle. Aww. <clears throat> you like him? Hey! Yep. Listen, Squeal, you better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze some little practice time before the race. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just dragging him along. Come on, you'll take it later. <laughs> He's barely fucking standing, too! Alright. Here we are. Go on, now jump off the edge and call your laughing. It's almost time for the ceremony, so try to practice seriously for once. Hmm? Oh, yeah. You can't sense your bird out there. She's like, hmm, oh yeah, you can't sense your bird out there? Like, oh yeah, really? God, oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out of having practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Oh shit. Oh, oh, Avi? Oh, God. I guess we go. Go ahead, just press down and call your laughing. All right. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Hmm. This bird is sure taking a long time to get here. Oh god. Something's wrong! Oh god. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh god, there's me god, got you! Don't <laughs> be being dangled like that! <laughs> I know, right? Looks. Did, did they just crash? Did he just crash into the ground? Oh. No. Are you two all right? <sighs> I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. You didn't spring your wing, did you? <laughs> oh. This is very odd, Squeakle. What could have possibly happened to your loft wing? For a bird to ignore the call of his master is unheard of. And you still can't sense your bird nearby, eh, Squeagle? This is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. You know, when you said you couldn't sense your love wing, well, I should have believed you. I'm sorry. Uh, I need to send to my own love wing, so I'll catch up with you later. 
You better go on ahead and see if you can go find wherever your bird has gone. <laughs> oh shit. Wait. Ooh. Mm. How did it get be so late? If I recall correctly, this year Instructor Harwell is presiding over the ceremony. Squiggle, you should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little just so you can find your bird. <coughs> Understood. Yep. I think we'll end this first episode when we get... Th yeah, okay. Gosh, gotcha. Father, you're the headmaster of the, ac the academy. If Squiggle asks Instructor Horwell, he'll probably just come talk to you about it. Ah, oh, oh. uh, you're <laughs> quite true as usual. You make an excellent point, my dear. Very well. I'll explain the situation to him myself. Squiggle, run along and come see me in my quarter. Or, sorry, tell Instructor how I will to see me in my quarters. Well, let's check on Zelda first. Yep. Aw, burp is tired. Squiggle, I'm going to tend to my bird and make sure he's not hurt. I'll catch up with you later. Go ahead and see if anyone in town knows what happened to your little Oh, he's just sleepy out. Like, he's like, owie. I did too much. Right? <laughs> Poor baby. <gasps> oh my god, look at the bird! The, on the. Th <laughs> God. Stupid, I love it. Man, Merton Blank knows how to move fast. Hey. Hey. You can tell why I love this game, too. Man, they can do it in so many styles in the game. It's just like, yeah, it's good. Yep. That's why I love Zelda. That's so good. Such a good series. Do, 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 do. Man, open doors for a lady anymore. How long am I supposed to stand here waiting for a little shivery? <laughs> hmm? I was trying to figure out like a voice for her, but I paused for a second. Yeah. Oh, it's you, Squiggle. Say, you look all flustered. Did something happen? What? You can't find your lock leak. Uh, I don't know what to tell you. I've been here at school this whole time. Well, thank you, anyways. No. What's wrong, Squiggle? You're looking a bit pale. What? Your loft wing is missing. It, how strange and troubling. Do you, you think you could find him? You're going to start looking for him now? Oh, how will you make it back in time to fly the ceremony? Looks like your participation in the ceremony hinges on a feather. Uh, not that you could find your bird on time. <laughs> Excuse me. I see. So the headmaster has summoned me? Alright, then I'll go speak with him immediately. I still owe you for helping me earlier, so don't worry about the ceremony for now. You focus on finding your loft wing. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Whew. Let's find, let's see let's see if anybody knows anything. Yeah. <clears throat> hey, is anybody taking a bath? Just kidding, Lamel. This cozy. Ah. Underwater? The music gets, uh... Yeah, that's interesting. Let's go. I forgot that was even a detail in this game. I just did that for funniest, and I'm like, Hey, this is a good moment for a fun fact! <laughs> that's so cool. I like that. Skyloft map. Oh. North statue of the goddess, east. Okay. We we're going to all those anyways. Let's go into Zelda's room, JK Lamo. Imagine how much trouble we get. Alright. Shock the horrible. Nope. No. Okay. Nope. No. That's the headmaster's room. Oh! <laughs> Just oh. go right in! And he's not here. <laughs> god. <laughs> oh my god! Rude. Can you knock the books out of the shelves? I right? wish. Can you imagine making this whole the whole fucking rest? His whole room uh, a whole mess? I wish that I wish that would be cool if the, the game added that. <laughs> and rude. Pippin! Yeah. No, Pippin! You're, you're not still running around at the academy, are you? <laughs> what? what? Your love wing won't come when you call for it. Why would a guardian bird not come when it's called? You know, I've never heard of this happening before, so I can't even tell you what you're doing wrong. But a good senior never hangs an underclassman out to dry. We'll figure this out together. 
You go to the plaza and ask people if they know anything in the meantime. I'll ask around here. Thank you, Pippin. Thank you, Pippin. You're awesome. <coughs> Appreciate you. What's wrong, Squeak? Your bird won't come to you when you call it. For a Loftwing to ignore its master's call, something must be very wrong. Have you talked to Instructor Horwell about this? He's leading today's ceremony and should be aware, made aware of what's going on. I see. Well, if Headmaster is aware of the situation, then I'm sure he'll delay the ceremony for you. You just worry about finding that bird of yours. <coughs> Thank you! <coughs> All the help matters! Yep. Nope. Oh. There's nothing I can use in my room. I've already cleared that out. Yeah. This is one of those Zelda games where we can take our time to just say hi to everybody and everything, so no worries. Mm. I like that. <clears throat> <sighs> Thanks, that was a huge jump, Squeakle. <laughs> I know it's not much, but here's half of my pay the old lady offered me to do that. <laughs> We're gonna get $40 okay. to move two barrels?! Damn! <laughs> hey. I have to hang back and watch the academy today. Good luck with the ceremony, Sweagle. Well, uh, about that. Uh? What's wrong, Sweagle? You don't know where your bird is. Um, what are you talking about, Sweagle? You called it, but it didn't even come to you. So that means. Oh, I knew it. Huh? huh? Oh, nothing really. I was uh, talking to myself, to know, like I do. What do you know, Fledge? Well, I know he's- we, we already know he's not a bad guy. Fledge is cool. Yeah. Uh -huh. I ain't talking to me about your laughing right now. I'm a little busy or so fucking worried. Damn. <laughs> well, to be fair, she's been in the kitchen all day, so I doubt she would know. Yeah, that's so funny. Oh, well. Well, let's go to the plaza. All the gates are open now, so... Hell yeah. Sweet. Alright. Let's take a run! Yeah. This game's so pretty. Aw. Do that again? No, you're watching. <laughs> you're watching. He's on. Nope, you're still watching him. <gasps> oh, yes, yeah, Squeaker. Hey, hey, Squeaker. Did you help me with something? I have to do is dash and roll into the tree. Just like I've been doing. Dash, then when you're in front of the tree, bam! Do a roll right into it. So come on, please. <laughs> also, goal, like Seagull. <laughs> He squeaked! I know, right? Amazing. Oh, he Aww, missed it. Aw. Aw, my sky stag beetle. So close. Oh, well, to catch it, I would need a bug net, anyways. I wish I had thrown out the one I bought at Beetle's air shop. Aw. Aw. Poor guy. <laughs> Hey. Nice to know we can just do that now. Yes. Skyloft Plaza. Okay. Let's go in here and see what's up. Recognize that music? Yep. Bet you do. <laughs> yep. Ooh. Hey, Squiggle! Today's the big day, isn't it? You know, the wing ceremony thing. Pharaoh? Like parrot? It's Pharaoh? Yep. <laughs> yep. Win this thing and you'll get bumped up to the senior class. <laughs> Here in Skyloft, it's being able to ride a loft wing that separates the kids from the adults. And if your goal is to become a knight, well, the good technique is even more important. All of us learn to fly the hard way. Lots of practice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nice house, by the way. Very cozy. Yeah. A nice house. I love how this pl this whole place is just so sweet that everybody can just visit and be like, hi! Right? Also, I like how there's just hearts on the plants. Right? Yeah. <laughs> hi! 
Hey, Squeakle, how's it going? The wing ceremony's about to begin, right? Remember when Pippet won the last one right at the last second? It was so close! Now that was a race! Hey, your Crimson Lostwing will be in the race, right? I'm looking forward to seeing what he can do. Thank you, I appreciate the, the confidence. That was nice, yeah. Oh, oh, here we go! Here we go! Best character yeah. in the game! You know, Bruce, that sure was a pain with all the scratching and pecking. <laughs> of course it was. You thought a big crimson loft wing like that was gonna go down without a fight. But we got him, and I don't care how tough those birds are supposed to be. He's not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. <laughs> like I said, he's the best character. You'll s you'll understand later on. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, uh, Squeagle! <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Just how long have you been standing there? <laughs> What's your problem, anyways? <laughs> oh, I got it! You're here to talk about today's race! I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. Rude. Huh? I'm pleading- Oh, Groose, can you please find it in your heart to let me win today, please? You're just desperate to win, so you can get some alone time with Zelda up on the statue of the goddess at the end of the ceremony. <laughs> well, sorry, pal. Groos doesn't do charity for wimps. My advice. Work hard and wish with all your heart. You may even come in second. Ooh? Say, come to think of it. How come I don't see your bird? Where's that scruffy pile of red feathers? I can't imagine what could have happened to you. Do you think his tiny brain got confused by all the clouds and got lost? Oh, yeah. which one? Which one? Nice hair, bring it on or give him peck. Uh, nice hair. Agreed. Or... Agreed. Yeah. Nice hair. <clears throat> you lay off my dude right now or I'll flatten you. Everyone knows I've got the slickest pompadour in <laughs> town. Love it. You know, we're all getting tired of how you never let anyone forget you and Zelda go way back. <laughs> You've been friends since you were kids, right? Big deal. Doesn't change the fact that you float through life with your head in the clouds. Would you wake up, straighten up, and grow a backbone already? Don't like you are dragging our honored academy through the mud. Jesus. <laughs> right? Right. <laughs> He's easy. Uh -oh. Like oh shit. <laughs> I just what you need to talk about, Bruce. Uh -oh. You made her mad. Look at your head. Gonna kick oh. her ass. Oh, uh, Zelda. Hey, no, it's. Uh... By the way, you're gonna love Zelda in this game. Oh boy. Huh? Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. Don't even try, Bruce. You're picking on Squeagle again, aren't you? The way she pushed Sque Link out of the way to be like, you fucking listen here. Right? <laughs> Actual, my boyfriend, uh, he asked for no pickles moment. For real. Jesus, stood at the academy like all of us. No. <laughs> Why do you insist on bullying him around so much? <clears throat> yeah, I suppose. <laughs> you suppose? Suppose what? <laughs> Angie. I suppose you, uh... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Forget it, I wasn't supposed to get anything, okay? He's in love with her. Aw. <laughs> okay, we're out of here, boys! Later, Sweagle, hope you find your bird. Or else you're going to have to sit out today's race. That could be a major setback towards knighthood, so find that bird! Or get real used to the taste of failure. It's your special flavor. Whoops, excuse me for that one. <laughs> also, also, so that's why he's bullying, please, Weagle. <coughs> yep. <coughs> I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect that those blockheads had something to do with your little friends and spirits. So, Weagle, those guys aren't to going to help us find your birds, so we'd better start searching. <coughs> I'll fly around Skyloft and see if I can spot any trace of your bird. Thank you, Zelda. Father said he talked to Sector Horwell about the lane start of the wing ceremony, so don't worry, we'll find your bird in time. Aw. Thank you, Zelda. Did she just wing at him? Bye, Wait. Zelda. Hi, Zelda. <laughs> 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 Zelda. 
Oops. Hey. <laughs> I love that they just jump. That's how I missed hey. it, but I think you, I think she did. <laughs> look like she winked at him. This looks really cute. Well. Find the burb. Time to find that Boyd! We need some Boyd! <laughs> also, very pretty lady. Huh? Yeah, yeah. What's up, Squeagle? You seem to be in a hurry. What's this about a bird? Oh, that unusual script in the sky. Off wing. Have I seen yeah. him? I'm sorry, I haven't. Mm. Shut up. No. I forgot, to, I forgot to read for a second. <laughs> yep. Stinky. Why don't you look for him by those statues of the goddess? You'll have a good view of the whole town from way up there. Statue of the Goddess, a huge statue in this north of Skyloft. You've been there, right? Head to toward there, blah, 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 blah. Mm. If you're ever lost, you can... Yeah. Well... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Link's face is great. Alright. Well, I think I have an idea of where to go. Let's say hi to everyone. some other people first, though. Hi! Baby. Adorable, hi, by the way. Amigo. I just asked me like to cook you. Psst. By the way, that's me. <laughs> I'm gonna go play with my special friend today. It's going to be so much fun. Absolutely adorable. Right? Okay, you know what? Let's head this way. Okay. Hello. Oh. Look at this thing. Who no love long who knows how long the statue's been here? And only has one eye, poor thing. You probably know this, but yes, I know. <laughs> where, did that, where did that come into the conversation? Okay. Did you know if you press the silly button, you can look up? Well... Right? I already know you have to go here, that's why I just... Yeah. Ah, okay. Oh, Angie. Yeah. Waterfall cave. Beware blood-sucking monsters. No oh kids allowed. Okay. Well. Before we come, we're becoming a knight. Right. Oh yeah. And we're becoming a knight at the academy, then surely... That means we should go back to the academy and see if we can... Get ourselves our hands on a sword of some sort, right? Yeah. Well, let's go Seems see. Seems like the most logical thing to do. Yep. Oh, he's tired. Yep. <coughs> All right, let's go get ourselves a a sword. <coughs> yeah, a save sword. Our, save our verb. There we are. Hey, there's you two. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Squiggle, perfect timing. I heard your loved wing has gone missing, so I thought I'd join in the search. And get this, when I asked Fledge what he knew, he started acting weird. Mm. I, I'm so sorry, Squeagle. I, I really wanted to tell you, but if Groose found out, I told you. <sighs> Sounds like Groose forced him to stay quiet about it. <clears throat> Go on. Tell him the truth. <sighs> Just a little while ago, when I was cleaning the dining hall, Groose and his buddies came in. Uh -oh. They didn't notice I was there and started talking about their plans to hide your loft wing. I wanted to warn you, Sweagle, but I just as I tried to sneak away, Bruce and his gang grabbed me. They said if I told you, they'd make sure I'd never be able to ride a bird ever again. Right. It sounds like Bruce and his buddies had a plan to capture your bird and hide him near the waterfall. Well, near a fall waterfall would mean... Quick, let's take a look at your map. That's it, right there. I think it means the waterfall marked with X. Believe it or not, I just went there. Give me Squeagle, I can't help but being such a coward. I'm really sorry. <coughs> well, I already went there. <coughs> if you're going out to the waterfall, remember that there are some dangerous things there. Creepy, crawly things. You'll need to carry a sword. I think I saw night com the night commander go into the sparring hall a while ago. You should ask him if you can go borrow one. Okay. <coughs> Good place to start. Yeah. Hey, it's Squiggle. Eagles, like eagle. Yep. 
So you still want to get in some sword practice, even though today is the wing ceremony? <laughs> I'm impressed. The sword is in the back room. Go back there and get it. I'll be here for a while, so if there's anything you don't understand about handling a sword, go right ahead and ask. <sighs> Tana, here we go. Come on, come on, yep. <clears throat> you got a practice sword. Students at a nice academy practice with these. Looks like it's a fairly sharp blade. That. Oh, yeah. Nice sword. <clears throat> Good one to start with. Yes, game. I'm aware. <laughs> Alright. So that one we... That... That one we... Wait. Let me, let me target it. There we go. If I target it, it'll work. There we go. My enemy! <laughs> Shit. Imagine if we had health bars for these. God. Straight down! Wait. Straight down. Straight down. In the middle? Straight down. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Takes a little to get used to, but, you know. And Pokey Stabby. That's right, Spiegel. You really are a strong swordsman. Easy to teach, too. You make this instructor proud. Are you ready to try a spin attack? Oh, uh, yes. <clears throat> now I'm going to surround you with logs. You should spin attack to cut them all without moving from that spot. <laughs> good one! <clears throat> oh, yeah. That sure looked like it felt good. <laughs> so why don't you try a fatal blow to close out our session? Sure thing. <laughs> My enemies down target it with ZL to throw yourself at it to land a flatal blow. Do a side slash on that log, but it's down try finishing it off. Holy shit. That's the way. <laughs> fatal blow is also an effective move to use right after you use your shield or well placed spin attack to knock the enemy on its back. Oh, but monsters don't stay down for long, so they'll have to land that fatal blow quick before they get up. Wait. Pokey, pokey. Sideways. Here we go. Poke. Sideways. Sideways. Alright, let's ask him about borrowing it now. Oh yeah, you want to learn about how to use a sword? Yes, please. <coughs> yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. yep. Alright, so let's leave with the sword, get yelled at, and then... Okay. <laughs> Swinging the controller around to do this is so fun! <laughs> hey, Squiggle! Can't take swords outside of this boring hall. What do you think you're doing, sneaking out with that? <coughs> well, sir, my bird... What? Your loft wing's missing? You wanna go look for it? Well, I guess I could make an exception just this once, but remember that Skyloft is a peaceful place. Only knights carry swords. So I don't wanna see you swinging it around like crazy out there. I don't wanna get a ton of trouble over this, so here's the deal. Make sure you get plenty of practice on these logs first. And use it only when you have to. Don't worry, okay. it's cause we already did them, we can just go bye bye. Oh, okay. I was about to say <coughs> Now then, now that we got a sword, Whee! <laughs> God. Listen, as advice. an upper classman, I've got some advice for you, sorry. There's something you should always do before you go somewhere dangerous. Oh, save. Yeah, <laughs> of course. Look at my sword. Look at my sword, everyone! I'm poking it in the air! God. Look, check this out. Nerd. <laughs> Nerd. <coughs> there we go. He's being silly, okay? Squiggle's having a good time. He is. I appreciate the idea that every generation of Link we make is gonna have a funny name now. Yes. Up until Breath of the Wild, they just you with the name Link. Yep. 
Was Breath of the Wild the only game that like, forced you to have Link as the name? Yep. Ah, oh, okay. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say it's because it's voice acting. Ah, that's why. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. It's time to do the the absolute classic way of getting money in Legend of Zelda. All right. It's time to cut the grass, which is a very fun way to say, "Hey, kids, cut the grass to get money for doing it." Not untrue. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, let's go save our bird. Yeah. Save Krim Krim. Yes, I named the bird Krim Krim. Shut up. I don't. Re I don't know if we could name our bird too. I hope so. I should know. Krim Krim sounds like my name. Scarlet. There you go. <laughs> You're cute. No, but that's not talk too serious. Compared to like, I don't know. I'd By the way, you know how we can do a spin attack, right? Yeah. Check this out. <laughs> oh shit! What the hell? <laughs> yep. We can do a reverse. <laughs> Vertical spin and a regular vertical spin. But that's good. <coughs> Link is really agile in this game. Oh, is it? <laughs> Sorry, Loft Wing. Look, I, I can smack in the trees and get money. The bird's like screaming at you. He's like, Stop hitting the shirt, do you ask? <laughs> <laughs> Bird's like, bruh. Like, really? R really, Link? Really, squeak <laughs> Alright, let's go after these baits. We're in the cave. Yep. Oh, shit. <laughs> Not today! <sighs> Kick the yeah. shit out of all of them. Yep. Oh! Squishy! Rude. Wasn't squishy for long. You killed the squishies, rude. Goodness. Yeah. Cutting the grass. Because rupees are helpful. We got 98 already, by the way. Oh, Actually, we got 100. 99. Yep. Hey. All right. I know they call called Chujis, but we're forever called Squishies. They're squishy. Just like you! A nice squishy no. face. Cute. I'll squish your face, asshole. Thank you. No. Oh my goodness. Is there a fish just left here? I hit that one twice, midair. Yeah. Imagine getting it caught in all of that. I do like the only directional swinging you can do is fun. Come on! Ow! <laughs> so how do you like the style of this game, and how do you like the game in general, I should ask? I like it. I'm glad. <laughs> Party. It feels like it's kind of a mix between two Link style and the regular style of GSP. I love it, yeah. I think that's why I like it so much. I like it. It's got that really artsy style to it while also like being realistic. Yeah. It's cool. It's cool. <laughs> oh, every Zelda game just hits that right tone with me. No matter which yeah. one it is. Get out of here! Jesus got a swinging arm the way he absolutely <laughs> flings them away, by the way. Right? Right? Also, did you know Link is usually left when it used to be left-handed usually? Yeah. I'm pretty sure you knew that. I think it was because of Master Quest on the GameCube or something that they changed that? Can't remember. Maybe. I think there was a version where, you, where Link was left-handed in this game. Excuse me, Link. Let's not let's not I mean sorry. What's his name? Squeagle. Squeagle, let's not have a, ding a, a binkus moment where we can't crawl, okay? There we go. <laughs> Climbing all over the walls and shit. Yep. Also, you missed the blue rupee. 
That, oh, well, that's, it probably disappeared already. They got time limits on them. Uh. <clears throat> okay. We're already 50 minutes in. <laughs> Wait. <clears throat> and an hour into the recording, but that's okay. We're fine. Hey! Squish! <laughs> 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 Hey, Squeagle. I was hoping I'd find you here. I heard that you'd gone searching for your bird around the waterfall, so I thought I'd fly around and help you look. How's your search going? Any sign of your off wing? <sighs> oh, no. Well, let's not lose hope yet. There's a place up, up ahead that Bruce and his gang are always hanging around. Maybe we'll find something there. Uh -huh. Huh? Who's that? Who's calling for me? Oh, sorry. Squeagle, I got distracted for a moment. Let's go. What the hell? I felt also, a cloud lot. tornado. Cloud <coughs> tornado. Over yep. there. The dome! Da 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 dome! We follow you. Oh, oh. Huh? Look, there he is! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no doubt about it. They He's like, get me the fuck out of here! He's like, <laughs> die, dear God, help me! I love the way Zelda little runs. It's cute. <laughs> Her little run is adorable. I got What's you, buddy. Hmm. Maybe the rope. You have to slash it. Good call. You're right. <laughs> yep. There you go. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Shake his little butt. <laughs> there you go. Say happy love word. Say like, yay, I'm free. Aww. Feels Pretty good to spread your wings again, huh? <laughs> 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 right? <laughs> what is all those little giggles and drops? <laughs> right? <coughs> Link is so happy now. Right? He's like, yay. Aw. He's so, so happy! Now that you're laughing, it's free. You should find some ceremony. I know, right? Before you go, I have to ask you something. I heard this voice a few moments ago. Did you hear it? It's been happening a lot lately. It's the strangest feeling. Almost like someone's calling out to me. Huh. Interesting. Have you ever wondered what's beneath the clouds? That's a loaded question out of nowhere! Right? <coughs> Some say that it's an empty, barren place. Or even that there's nothing at all down below. But I just have this feeling that there... That they're wrong. Some of all old texts talk about a place called the surface. The old tales describe the whole other world underneath here. It's far more vast than the skyline. <laughs> you don't know half of it. Shit. The thing is, no one's ever <coughs> been down there to see it, and our loft wings will fly through the barrier. Cloud barrier. But I can't help imagine the wild thing that might be waiting down below. Someday, I want to see it for myself. <laughs> oh, sorry, Squeagle. We don't have time to talk. Let's get that going. Look, your friend, your wait, friend's waiting for you. Just leap off the edge and blah 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 blah. <coughs> Alrighty then. <laughs> He's so full of joy. Oh yeah, that's right. This is the first time you're really seeing him give off emotion. Too. Yeah. Hell yeah. Bird. Thank you. Here you go. Let's run your bird through the basics just to make sure he's not hurt. 
fly your bird in any direction, blah 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 blah. When it's headed upward, I'll just see you. I think it's funny because our own stuff is not gonna bother reading it. <laughs> going pretty well. Yeah. Uh, I guess maybe for a scare mode you can. Yeah. Watch the charge. Whee! I just realized it's very funny. What? That, um. Well. That's a huge relief. I don't know when, I don't know how easy we go, but your lock wing looks like it's flying great. Tears of the Kingdom, floating islands. Starboard sword. Oh wait, you're right, shit. <laughs> it's really funny how we just decided to play this now, considering both have those. Right. That is funny as shit. <laughs> that is funny. My father and the others are probably worried about your bird, so let's go give them good news. Oh yeah. Our bird is happy. The do 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 do. Hell yeah. Aw. Oh, Your laughing really is amazing, especially considering everything that the poor guy has been through this morning. I'm gonna fly back and tell Father what happened. That little bird is cute. Ah, <laughs> oh, here he is! Well, 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 if it isn't Squeagle. I think that's the voice we're going with him. Yep. Word around the plaza is you found that dumb bird of yours. <laughs> well, that's just great. Because you and your dumb bird can't tell time. All the pre-race warm-ups and this guy's did were, me and the guys did were for nothing. Now I'm all stiff. Been waiting forever for the race to start, and they delay it for you? I don't get it. Some big flake that's got suspectful treatment. <laughs> You're almost a man, yet you still can't seem to go anywhere without Zelda. I bet you can't even decide to have your lunch on your own, huh? I don't think we haven't noticed a smug looks. Oh, Zelda and I are best friends wherever we go together. Ugh. Bam. You think you're pretty suave, don't you? Well, don't you? Bruce has been going on forever about he's gonna be the one to be with Zelda. He's really got his pompadour and a ruffle about her. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, but today's the day I bust up this adorable little fantasy land you're living in. Zelda's playing the role of goddess in today's ceremony, and I'm gonna be the one to come let self off. When I heard she made it herself, man, our way I was gonna let some scrawny clown snatch that prize from me. Oh yes, that's sailcloth. Zelda sailcloth will you mind. <laughs> right. Oh man, I always think she was so thinking about me when she was snatching it. Yep, I can see it now. First I win the big race and Zelda and I finish the ceremony to on the statue. Just the two of us. Be our special moment alone. Nobody is stopping me from z I'm <laughs> this guy. <laughs> oh yeah, look at his fucking face. Right? Bruce, Bruce, behind you! Right behind you! Oh shit! Oh shit! Well, can't you two see him in the middle of? Oh no! Oh, oh, she heard everything. <laughs> yep. God. <laughs> Care to explain just what you meant by our special moment together alone? <laughs> I, uh, nothing big, really, just, just... Squiggle, yeah, I was telling my buddy here how glad he was he found that red bird of his. Boy, I'm looking forward to a fair race. It's God. Anyhow, later, Zelda, look for me during the race. I'll be the one pulling off all the dangerous moves. <laughs> Zelda's just like the fucking nerve. All right. <gasps> my goose, wait up! 
You know that guy, a fair race? Yeah, the chance of that happening is about less than zero. Either way, don't let these fools get you down, Squeagle. Just get out of there and fly the best you can. I know you got the guys beat, and deep down I think you do too. Yeah! I don't know. Or, us alone, or... Us alone? Sure. Come on, Squeak, I'll try to focus on one. No. <laughs> <Hey! coughs> the wing ceremony will now begin. Participants, I mean, participating students, please assemble. Looks like it's race time. Good luck, Squeagle. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Bird time! Bird time. <laughs> Alrighty! <coughs> hey! A pretty yellow word. Your attention, please. At last, we are ready to begin the wing ceremony. I was beginning to worry that we'd have to proceed without Squeagle, but luckily that is no longer a concern. Oh yeah, that's Alan, he's calmer. I'm glad hey. you could all make it. Before we start, I'll explain the rules for today's competition. <coughs> I've attached a small statuette to this bird. Well, I will then release the disguise look at it. She's just like, hey, what? Boy. <laughs> that's right. cute. That On my cute. signal, dash from the starting line and dive off the ledge. Once you're in the air, mount your loft wing. Remember to call your bird promptly after you dive off the edge. Well, I just co whoever catches the bird and claims the statuette will be this year's champion. Those are the rules. Simple enough, I should think, but do you need to hear them again? Nope. Nope. <coughs> We're good. <laughs> Excellent. As you well know, today's champion will graduate to the class, uh, to the next class, bringing him one step closer to knighthood. He will also receive a gift from the young woman chosen to play the role of the goddess in this year's ritual. Today is a special day for many reasons, but it's also the 25th anniversary of our fine institution. To celebrate the occasion, today's champion shall also receive his gift high atop the statue of the goddess. I hear the young woman performing the role of the goddess this year has created the gift herself. And as you all well know, the role of the goddess this year will be performed by... <coughs> Aww. Aww. The lovely Zelda. <laughs> oh, it is you. Forgot. Oh, whoops. Let's see your finest flying out there. Show me how hard you've been practicing. Also, I want to see good, clean flying. Anyone caught interfering with other riders will answer to me. Cool! Oh, shit. <coughs> that goes double for you, Groose! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Scared the shit out of him, by the way. Right. <laughs> All right, gentlemen, line up at my command. The competition will begin. Hey! <coughs> Go! <laughs> yeah. Go! Hey! Go! Come on, get it! We're right back! Oh, hey, didn't you know this is my day to get the glory? <laughs> yeah, you heard him. Let's see how you fly with egg on your face. It's not a fact. Alright. Let's do this! <laughs> Come on. Come on. Yay! You got the bird statue It proves your victory today. Wait till Zelda sees this. By the way, that's the fastest I've ever done this mission. Holy shit. Proud of you. Thank you. <laughs> Makes me happy. Look at him. He's like, yeah! Aww. Yay. It's cool. Oh. <laughs> oh shit. Aw. <laughs> Look at them! <laughs> They're absolute sweethearts! Dorks. Don't worry, you're fine. <laughs> Great flying, Spiegel. Congratulations! They're Aww. so cute! I... Fucking <gasps> <laughs> nerds. I think it's Not absolutely either. no secret Sorry. that these two are in love. Like, yep. this game makes it very fucking obvious. 100%. Yeah. They're fucking sweethearts. 
Here you go, hand me that bird statue you grabbed in the trace. I must offer it to the goddess. They're cute. They are cute. I think I might be right to make this one as long as I'm trying to make it. Okay. It depends. Oh, I love the music in this game! <clears throat> Every Zelda game has music, but just mm. right. Oh. Great goddess, guiding light and protector of our people, grant us your blessing and mercy as I act in your stead during the ceremony. Valiant youth who grasp victory at the celebration of the bird folk. In accordance with the old ways, I now best bestow the best blessings of the goddess upon you. <laughs> the blessings of the goddess drift down from the heavens aloft the sail, which I now pass on to you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I love <Stupid>. him. <laughs> I love this kid. Amazing. He now jumped from any height without the feel of fear of a painful landing. It smells nice too. Aw. Link! Aw. <laughs> he loves her, okay? This is cute. Here you go. <laughs> thing. This she is supposed calls to be him a out on it. Ritual, <laughs> she Amazing. calls him out on it. I love it. Love it. You know, they say that the goddess gave a seal cloth to her chosen hero a long time ago. Yeah. Of course, the one you're holding isn't the same one. I've been working hard to finish making the seal cloth in time to give it to today's champion. I'm really glad I got to give it to you. Here you go. <laughs> Make sure you take good care of it, okay? You notice how she said the first part really slowly, too? Right? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat drywall in a second, swear to God. Right? Too cute. Thanks for making it up here to do this with me today, just like you promised, Squeagle. Oh, <laughs> He's just like, yeet! <laughs> He's like, yeet! Now we really should finish up this ritual. Oh, You do know what happens at the, the end, right? <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> just go, nope. Really? Huh. I thought you would have figured it out by now. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> you have to jump on the <laughs> I thought they were about to kiss. Right. Look down. See that big round design on the courtyard below? To finish the ceremony, you need to drop down right into the center of it. Leap off the edge here right before you hit the ground presses. Yeah. You so. Just how brave are you? If you were really fearless, you'd wait until the last second to use the other boss. So, ready to jump? <laughs> Shit. I love her. I love them! Date! I got. I got. <laughs> Holy shit! There we go. <sighs> well, we did it. <laughs> yeah. That was perfect! You're amazing, Squeagle! Aw, look at hey. him! <laughs> <coughs> She's shy, but she's still looking right at- <laughs> Cutie! These two are killing me. <clears throat> you know, Squeagle, seeing as how you want today. And with the weather being so nice- Just asking on a fucking date, pretty much. <laughs> yeah. He's like, hey, you think that maybe you would like to, you know, go fly around the clouds together? Cute! <laughs> Cute! My heart. That's why I love these fucking stupid games, man. Right? My heart. <laughs> They're so happy. Yeah. Squeagle? Hey, Squeagle!
Today was amazing, watching you win the race and performing the ritual together. I'll always remember this. Oh, oh. It really was wonderful. <laughs> you know, Spiegel. There's something I've been meaning to talk to you about. Oh shit. <laughs> oh fuck. <clears throat> what is that? Oh, the music. Right? Right. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> What's going on? Oh shit. Oh god, Zelda! Oh god! Oh, god. It. Oh god! Hi, hi. I am waiting for you. I'm in love! <laughs> the time has come for you to awaken. You are vital to a mission of great importance. Mick, it's a sword. And? <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> Fuck the sword. You see how pretty that sword is, man? Fucking... <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> come on, Save get her! her! Oh god. When your loved one carried you back, you were limp and unconscious. I feared the worst. Oh god. Fortunately, you don't appear to have any serious injuries. For that much, we can be grateful. <laughs> but Squeagle, where's Zelda? She was with you, was she not? Oh no, oh. they don't even know! Ah! <laughs> oh, no. What's happened to my daughter? Oh. Oh. Link speaking know. animation, by the way. Right? You know, like, I won the ritual, and then we went flying together, and then tornado happened. Black tornado, you say? That is no ordinary storm. Oh, man. <laughs> Oh, he's ready! He is ready to go right off yep. the bat! Well, he said. Must not push yourself, you're still recovering. At least how fast he was ready to just jump out of bed and get ready and do all right. that? Right? Tell me, when you saw Zelda today, did anything about her seem off? She was talking about a voice speaking to her, that's all I know. She wanted to ask me about it. Let's see, she was talking about the surface then. You've been having dreams about a great mission. How interesting. Ooh. I'm sorry, I was lost in thought there for a moment. It's all very strange, but I doubt there's much of a connection between these things. I'm concerned for Zelda, but so long as she's with her Loftwing, I'm sure she'll be fine. Either way, daybreak has yet to arrive. It would be very difficult to spot one girl and her bird in the dark of night. It would also be very dangerous. <coughs> oh, man. Rest now, Squeagle. <laughs> Zelda's going to be fine. She's out there alive. I know it. Huh? <laughs> oh, man! Wait. <clears throat> Poor Link, man. Look at him. He's like... I can sh oh. Oh, shit. I wonder who that could be. <clears throat> I don't see why we shouldn't check it out. Hey. Well, what do you know? I gotta go to the beach! I'm kidding. <laughs> Nerd. Everything about Fee, including her music and the way she speaks and everything, is just so pretty. 
What? I'm sorry. <clears throat> There's now some time for it. This is a very pretty scene. Okay. Nerd. <clears throat> Don't worry about it. It's fine. Nerd. No, it's just like, it's fine. Don't worry about it. S sword <laughs> simp. Sword simp. Sword simp. Would that make it s make me a swimp? <laughs> yeah. There you go. Oh, the music is so <laughs> pretty. Hey. Oh, nothing gets you. Nothing increases your bond with a sword. Stop. <laughs> so if Link learned I mean, how to, so if Link learned how to sword swallow. Oh, shut up. <laughs> I mean, they do call the funny woman bits the the sword holder or something. The sheath. Yeah. Over there. Like in ancient times or whatever they used to call them. <laughs> yeah. It's the kitty. Oh. Damn. Oh shit. <laughs> Scared shit out of me. Uh, how about no? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Watch out, Fee! I find Fee, Fi, Fall, I don't fucking know how to pronounce her name, don't worry about it. Wait. She's pretty, that's all you need to know. Yes. <laughs> fucking combo, you idiot! Hey. That's for screwing me off in all patrol. Oh god! Karma. <laughs> oh shit! Watch your footing out there! In the dark, you'll never know when you might fight and take a wrong step off a long, wrong and death. Fuck! I did, 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 did. And I gave him a cool voice too, damn it. Kite, hey, by the way, cool. Up. Like that name. Oh, and don't let Kite me catch up. you going Kite. flying at night. Only trained knights as if I shall be doing that. You take care now. Yeah. You don't have to be so cool <laughs> about it! You're just a dude that appears as if you fall <laughs> off! You don't have to be that cool! Jeez! Cool ass characters for no reason. Damn. Fuck this game. Goodness gracious. Risky, risky business. I like Link's outfit in this game. That's nice. Pretty ass sword. Right. Excuse oh. me, Miss Fee. I don't think I could go. I don't think I could do that. Well, get good, idiot. Imagine. Imagine. <laughs> Fucking imagine. She just tells. <laughs> she just tells. Master, like sure, uh, it appears that you need to get good. <laughs> like what the fuck? Uh, so we're entering the statue's butthole. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> Apparently. Shit. He's like, what the fuck? Hi. <laughs> the one chosen by my creator. I have been waiting for you. You will play a role in my great destiny. Oh, in a great destiny. <laughs> According to your social customs, I should provide you with my personal designation. V or Fi? Well, both V, because it sounds cute. Oh, okay. Fi is the name I was given. I was created for a single purpose long before the recorded memory of your people. I must aid you in fulfilling the great destiny that is your burden to carry. Come, Squeagle. You must take up the sword as the one chosen by my creator. It is your destiny. He's like, what the fuck? The strange dreams troubling your sleep, a sudden appearance, uncertainty for surrounding the fate of one you hold dear. Under the circumstances, it is only logical that you would exhibit some uh, apprehension. 
You'll minimize your uncertainty. Allow me to share some information. My projections indicate that this information has a high probability of altering your current emotional state. <laughs> she talks like this a lot. Cute. The one you see, Honorable Zelda, is still alive. <laughs> oh. It's like, what? That smile! That smile is what I needed. And the spirit maiden, the one you call Zelda, is another chosen one faded to be part of the same group. <laughs> Therefore, should you wish to meet with your friend, I highly recommend you take up the sword before you set out to search for her. <laughs> Does that information invigorate you? Are you ready to accept the sword? <laughs> yes, ma'am! Damn, he's like, please, yes! And I... Let me save my wife! <laughs> it seems that further persuasive measures will not be required. <laughs> yeah, no, he's like... <laughs> Alright. <laughs> In the name of my creator, draw the sword and raise it skyward. Skyward sword, goddammit! Mm-hmm. Now I wonder what sword this could be. Yeah, to totally not the master sword. Nah, it's totally not. It's some other sword. There we go. It's Excalibur, okay. <laughs> the fa the fact you actually have to do the motion. Right. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> so cool. Right. You got the goddess sword, the mysterious sword bathed in divine light. So cool. Recognition complete, master. Please? Sorry. <laughs> oh, you're literally cute. Squeagle. My master. I don't, I don't have anything guessed it. What? <clears throat> Uh, uh, Zelda! <laughs> yes. Oh shit. Nerd? Squeagle! Ooh. I've had my suspicions, but until now I wasn't sure. Yet here we are in the Chamber of the Sword. The very place where it was foretold the youth of legend would one, one day appear. <coughs> it is said that this place was left to our people by the goddess herself. The very knowledge of this room's existence is a secret passed down to a select few each generation. Along with a handful of words. <clears throat> when the light of the goddess sword shines bright, the great apocalypse will take form. Will wake from its long slumber. Damn. Oh shit. <clears throat> Do not fear, for it is then that a youth guided by my hand shall reveal himself in the place most sacred. It started days ago. The sword that I've kept secret all these years began to give off a faint otherworldly light. Oh shit. <clears throat> At first, I was sure I was seeing things. Here alone with the sword, there was simply no other explanation. I never dreamed the prophecy of legend would come to pass in my lifetime. <clears throat> the words I have sworn to keep secret are coming true before my very eyes. The youth will be guided by one born of the blade, one who is also useful in likeness, yet wise with knowledge immeasurable. <laughs> ah, yes. The oral tradition, one of the least reliable methods of information retention and transmission. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> right. It appears that the critical sections of the passage have been lost over the generations. <clears throat> Do the pretty dance, because you're pretty. <laughs> Probably not yet. The draws forth the guiding sword, probably known as the goddess's chosen hero, and it is he who possesses an unbreakable spirit. He shall be burdened with the task of abolishing the shadow of the apocalypse from the land. Such as the Imagine just feed just stumbling over words. Right. Really funny. Every it's time we see her already, we keep seeing the wings of the uh, crest behind her. That is so cool. Like, almost every time. That is really cool, actually. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Spirit of the blade at his side, he shall soar over the clouds and pump below. United with the spirit maiden, he shall bring forth a piercing light that resurrects the land. <laughs> oh, so 
fonts all text talk about a place called the surface. The, ta the old tales describe a whole world below, far, far more vast than Skyloft. Who's like, what the fuck? Master, you must embark on a great journey being beneath the clouds to the vast realm of the surface. It is only through this journey that you can fulfill the mission set before my creator. Before by my creator, the goddess. It is also the only method available for you to reunite with the spirit made in honor of Zola. This is no easy task, Squeagle. The world below is a forsaken place, and the reaching must pierce the cloud barrier below. In living memory, no one has ever done this. This tablet will eliminate a path through the clouds to the below. Take it and place it within the altar behind me. Got the emerald Aye. tablet. The weathered surface of this heavy storm feels very old. Master, the first thing you must do is hit the crest sitting in this room with the skyward strike. These blasts are formed of pure energy that, carves, that charges within your blade when you lift it skyward. Once you have charged your blade, face the crest and swing your sword to send out a powerful skyward strike. Exact same time too. <laughs> right. <laughs> I love it. Stop reading my mind, asshole. <laughs> no you. <laughs> no you piece of shit. No. -uh. <laughs> yeah. Stinky. No. -uh. Yeah. Yeah. Big old tablet. Stinky smelly head. It's a big old tablet. You're a big old tablet. Rude. Hey. <laughs> Get right, idiot. Pew. Now, a cloud barrier created by the goddess has separated the world you know from the one below. The tablet you place in the altar has opened a small rift in the barrier. You can use it to travel through the clouds to the world below. I have recognized you as my master, so it is my duty to follow you wherever you may go. Can I ask of other things? Stop! God! <laughs> I reside within your sword and will accompany you in your travels. Losing it right now. Squeagle, listen a moment. The nature of the great apocalypse mentioned in the old text is a complete mystery to me. But whatever it turns out to be, it seems that both you and Zelda have a big role to play in the destiny of this land. Just think. If what Fi- or sorry, Fee says is true. Zelda's alive, alive and no doubt coming to terms with whatever it is the goddess has in store for her. Should you should ha- should-, should <laughs> Yeah? Don't worry about it. Should you heed the call of destiny, I don't know what dangers you may have to face, Squeagle, especially down there. But if you decide- if you're dead- Yeah, oh my god! If you're dead Please, keep me. <laughs> Do it, go ahead. I but can't. if you've decided Thank to brave the unknown, please find my daughter and bring her back to me. Thank you, appreciate you doing this for me. My brain's stupid. Well, we've seen here today the five explanation, but it's only the start of your journey. They see it to improve the us. No way. Okay. Ooh. I am white guy all of a sudden. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Kakashi, we'll do this just right. Sorry. Fucking imagine Link <laughs> with white guy's voice. Oh my god. Link, <laughs> you must save Hyrule. I'm on the job. Don't you worry god, a single it's like the most bit. Link god. <laughs> <laughs> All I need to do is to find the Triforce of Courage, and I'm gonna beat Ganondorf. I can't! I can't! I can't do this! <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Thank god Link doesn't speak. 
I mean, there's no text for him to speak. Dawn is drawing near. It is. Dawn is drawing near. It has been quite a long nine for the both of us, hasn't it? Sorry, I gotta stop. You have a great journey before. <laughs> You have a great journey to have for you. Oh my <laughs> god, it's good. Oh, this oh. They don't look up to the test. Oh, 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 wait, are we getting Karen. the new outfit? Oh god. Karen. <laughs> it's all just dead from the Karen for like zero. Hang on, I gotta pause for a sec. I'm gonna piss myself from laughing so hard. Hold on, be right back. Oh shit. The uniform you were to receive for running the race should be ready by now. A sturdy uniform like that will prove much more suitable for a long journey. You better change before you go. <laughs> Hell yeah. Save your gal. We'll also have your second gal on your back. <laughs> there he is. There he is. I like that he's just watching him get dressed. <laughs> mm. I love the chainmail on it, by the way. That green know. uniform is what our knights will be wearing this year. To be honest, I have my doubts about the color. But oddly enough, Seeing you wear this uniform, I can't imagine a more fitting color for you. It's as though you were born to wear it. Yeah, uh -huh. if you only knew. Hey. <laughs> <Wait. coughs> there he is! There's, our, there's the boy. Take care on your journey, and be sure to stop by at some of the shops of the bazaar here in town to equip yourself properly for the travels ahead. I'll return to my quarters and see if I can glean more useful information for the ancient decks. You're always welcome to my stop. You're always welcome to stop by if you have questions. You and Zelda shall be in my prayers. May the goddess watch over and guide you both. Thank you, Headmaster. <clears throat> Hell yeah. Hmm. I hear your spawning instructor, the Night Commander, also knows that you will set out from Skyloft to concern for you. Why don't you consider stopping beside and speaking with them before you go? Squeagle, be safe out there. I'm counting on you to find Zelda. Of course, Headmaster. Well, looks like we have a mission to do. Do 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 do. He said do 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 like a view. Squiggle. <clears throat> that green uniform looks so adventurous. You sure look like a knight now. The headmaster said you're heading out to look for Zelda. You're really something else. I could never imagine myself doing what you're about to do. I put oh. a lot of work into making this. You should take it with you. Oh, hell yeah! Heck yeah. It's an adventure pouch. It's four adventures. It's neat because you can fit four things in it that you'll need to make for your big up for your huge. Ah! Yeah? You can buy all kinds of stuff at the bazaar and put in this pouch. You should go look. <laughs> you can buy some potions and a shield. They fit in the pouch and they might come in handy on an adventure. Squeagle, I just know you'll find Zelda for us. Thank you for putting your faith in me, little guy. You know what? No, we're calling you Big Fella, okay? Feel good about yourself. You're strong. Ah! Ah, Squeagle, congratulations on advancing. Wow, so this year's night uniform is dark green, eh? Looks neat. <coughs> I bet Zelda will really have to see in that. Hmm? Oh, and don't worry. I'm sure she's fine wherever she is. She'll definitely be home soon. Better be. <laughs> Oh, yeah, we'll make sure of it. Don't you worry. <laughs> is Groose home? Yes, he is. Yep. Rub it in his face. <laughs> Fucking amazing. Of course. <laughs> For fuck? <laughs> Poor Zelda. <laughs> You, it's just your fault, you know. You barely fly straight, and yet somehow you beat me in the race. <laughs> it should have been me up there, not him! Sorry, I had you yo me, man. <laughs> right. It should have been me up there with her that day, but now I guess I'll just have to be the one to save her. <laughs> you really shouldn't open other people's covers without permission. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. Uh. <laughs> I'm just being funny silly, it's okay. I'm gonna say bye to everybody. 
I don't think Stitch is in here. A small room for the dude. It's like a closet. Yeah. Oh well. They probably chose it. What's in here? Probably. Fledge. We just talked to Fledge. I don't know why we're going in his room, but he's got a really comfy room. He does. A lot of pillows and stuff. Yeah. Hey! Hey, I, I just saw the news. Out of all of us, how come only you got promoted senior class? Tough got stupid calls. On top of all that, Groose will come out of his room and Zelda's missing! It's all your fault! Way to go there, buddy! Some senior class guy you are! <coughs> Kill your- I can't say that. Great. Ah. No, you're taking off on your journey now. You probably won't be eating here for a while. Well, take care of yourself. Make sure you come home every now and then. No one nothing but good sleep in your own bed. Aw. Good to know that I've still wandered around here. Yeah. <clears throat> well then. Off we go. Let's go see our, um... Our buddy. I think you have an idea of when I'm gonna stop the playthrough. Or this episode, I mean. You wanna take a guess? Uh, yep. In the next episode. No, no, I mean like do you wanna take a guess at when I'm gonna when I'm gonna really end it? Oh, when you go to the surface, I'm guessing? There you go. Ah, oh, okay. There you go. <laughs> you know exactly the right time to end it, just like I do. Yep. <clears throat> Perfect. Getting all the main story stuff out of the way, right? You know. Swish! Hey! Actually, yeah. Wait, alright. Target, slice. Shut up. Target, slice. Jab! Jab! There we go. Horizontal slice. From the top! Wait, from the top! That's much better. There we go. Squiggle, the headmaster told me about Zelda. Poor girl. I'm worried about her. Now, I don't know all the details of what's going on here, but that sword you're carrying isn't from Skyloft. It's an ancient artifact that only can be carried by the Chosen One. And since you happen to be the one carrying it, I guess I could figure out a lot of the rest of this crazy story. I wish there was something else I could do for you, Squiggle. Well, maybe there is. Get a shield from come back here. And I'll be able to teach you the secrets of the fence. It's the least I can do for you. I appreciate you! We get a free shield. Hey. Where? Wait, where do we get the shield? I may be stupid and already forgot what you said, my friend. What did you say? <laughs> oh, get a shield at the bazaar. Okay, thank you. Let's say hi to, hi to our new best friend. You called for me, Master? <laughs> Current session playtime is 1 hour and 49 minutes. Total playtime, yeah. I wish every Link could do that with Fee. Or Fi. I know, right? Yeah, Fee. We're calling her Fee because it sounds cute. <laughs> That's just so cool to be like, hey, Master Sword. Yeah? Kill this guy. Okay. Right. Even though that, that's not Fee, you have to do the killing. Oh! Whoa. Alden! I heard the news, Squeakle. Zelda's fallen down to the clouds and you're going to look for her, is that right? The headmaster told me there's land beneath the clouds. Do you know anything about that? So that's the famous sword. Ah, <laughs> but it wouldn't do you much good if you don't have a shield to protect yourself with. Take this with you. <laughs> Thank you! Okay. It breaks easily and can burn. Hey, listen. Ew. There's not exactly a metal shop up here, okay? Also so, true. So by, all me so by all means, the shield's a shield. Yeah. The wooden shield is light and maneuverable, but it's the weakest of all the shields. Keep in mind that it's particularly vulnerable to fire. If it breaks, you can buy a new one at the bazaar. If you're not sure how to use a shield, I wish to learn how to use a shield. There we go! I can shield bash, right? Bam! 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 Yep! There's a health bar at the top left, too. Oh, cool. Uh, I forgot how much I like the motion controls when it comes to fighting in this game. Ok. 
Okay, maybe if I faced it properly. Don't worry about it. Ooh. Impressive, okay, Squeagle. That's a nice shield you have there. Well, then it's time I taught you the art of defense. We'll start with basic training. When you're worried about defense, take your shield out. Simple stuff, I know, but you need to review the basics. True. Okay. Why don't you try that first? Okay. Parry! Thrust! Parry! Thrust! Wait, we can actually do that. Wait. Wait, we can actually do it. <laughs> thrust! Parry! Shit! <laughs> no, we gotta do this. We have to do this at least once. Yes. Thrust! Par wait. Parry! Thrust! <laughs> Fuck. Wait. We got this! Thrust! Parry! Thrust! Damn. You got it. We got to yeah. do the meme. It's okay. <laughs> the pearl meme. I think we're good. I gotta remember, it's like a pattern to it. First thing you gotta get real. Okay. Well, it's the fact that it works. Yeah. The pearl, the pearl bot playthrough, Lamel. The pearl protection projection the, playthrough. Uh, the hollow pearl. Hollow pearl playthrough. Congratulations. Perry, Perry, that's the Perry. <laughs> Love it. I don't know why, it's just really fun to see that from that one episode. <laughs> God. When Hall of Rose is being very annoying <laughs> and harassing Steven to just fight him. Right? Master, I have an update regarding the stone tablet and the resulting column of light created. Yeah? The column of light has appeared in the south of our location and signs indicate that it has created an opening in the cloud barrier. Explain below. <laughs> I must also caution you that descending to the surface uh, armed only with a sword would result in decreased probability of survival. Damn. If you have not already done so, I advise you to purchase a shield and potions yeah, at the bazaar in preparation for your journey. Yeah. Good news, Fee. We already got the shield. We just need the potions. They are starting us off early with potions, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's yeah, go to the bazaar. Uh, Usually it's like way later he gets potions. Look how happy the shit is. Right? Yeah. If you know, you know, Kiwi. <laughs> yep. Yep. Wow, he's really excited for us to buy. What happens if we walk away? Damn! Crushed his entire day. Yeah. <clears throat> Hey, you there! Yes, you! The adorable boy with the golden hair! Welcome to the potion shop! You can drink your potions when you're when you're injured to fill up your hearts. Hey, you're one of those knights, aren't you? Or one in training, at least. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you, one look at you and I can already tell that you'll need my potion by the, by the cauldron full. So don't try to sneak away without stocking up. Mm -hmm. Oh, dear! I forgot to ask if you have an empty bottle on you. Just so you know, I can't sell you a potion if you don't have an empty bottle on for mm. it, too. For some reason, I like you though, so I'll give you a spare empty bottle I've been keeping here in the slot. Oh, it's nothing. It's my little gift. Aw. You won't hear me say this often, but you can put other things besides potions in an empty bottle, so it's a useful thing to hear you around. Thank you, lady. Hmm. Ba 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 ba. If you ever get to the point where you can't fit any more stuff in your pouch because it's full, you can always drop items off at the mm. item truck. So, what would you like to buy? I would like to buy a nice red potion. Yeah. <coughs> That's Go ahead. a vat of heart potion. Drink this, a deer, and it will plunge you eat hearts. I'll just pick some up for your adventure. 20, 20 rupees. I think we can afford that. <laughs> I want to drink every heart potion ever. That looks so good. Wait. What do you think it tastes like? What do you think they all taste like? I have no <laughs> idea. Man. Thank you, sweetie. If you want potion covered, card up, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. 
<laughs> I got tired the green of one tastes like green apple. The red one tastes like the blood of our enemies. What? Just kidding. <laughs> That's how I'm looking at you right now. <laughs> what? What do you mean? What did I do? You know, <laughs> usually people would say fruit punch. I'm gonna say the red one tastes like cherries. You know what? Sure. The blue one will taste like the blueberry. I don't know. Maybe. I have no fucking idea. The purple one would taste like... Great. No. Yes. It would taste like yes? Okay, cool. <clears throat> and the magical super elixir one will taste like LSD. She has drugged that last one. We will die. Anyway, <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh... Hey, welcome to the scrap shop. I could use the stuff you find to upgrade your gear and make it even stronger. And if your shield takes a beating, no worries, I could fix that too. So what'll it be? Well, what kind of upgrades can we look to in the future? <laughs> you got it. There's no time. All the items I can upgrade right now. Ah! Look at that. Ooh. Wait, only 30 bucks? Ooh. Oh. I don't have any of the materials. Hey, hey. hey yeah. kid, I can't upgrade it. If you got the treasure, I need to do it. If I had, so what's nice is we can upgrade our items. So that's a good thing to keep in handy. No, wait, we have to get to the surface, but there's one area we have to get to, which then you'll definitely know the area we're saving at. Okay. Which is like, Basically, right next to where we're landing, so it's like no journey at all, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Alright, we got a potion, we got a shield. Okay. <laughs> I'd say. Listen, we got a hot sword wife, we got a cool wooden shield, we got a bottle of red potion, we got a new outfit. I don't know about yeah. you, but I think we're ready to go. I think so too. I think. Honestly. I think we are absolutely ready to conquer this awesome. day. Hey. Definitely. Here we go! Two hours in and we're about to hit the surface. I'd say that's a good amount of time we've been spending. Here we go. Come on! Come on! I already forgot what name I gave the, the funny bird. Here we go! That is a very long fall. Right? <laughs> Jesus. Well, this is the first look, look that Link has been having of the surface. Oh yeah, if that if you hear that, that's me resetting the gyro on the controller. Oh, okay. Hey. Wow. Pretty. Happy. Ah, <coughs> Master, please make sure to use your sailcloth when descending from high elevations. Failure to do so has a high probability of resulting in injury. I took the liberty of deploying the sailcloth for you this time, but in the future you can manually engage it by like a. Yeah. Master Squeagle, we've arrived. <laughs> this is the fabled surface that has long been part of Skyloft legend. <laughs> By my calculations, you are currently positioned in a location known as the Sealed Grounds. <laughs> oh. Pretty. Pretty nice place to start. Lots of green. Yeah. Green is good. Please proceed with the caution, Master. Can do fee. Got you by my side. Can do fee. You said can do fee. No, can do fee. Cutie. <laughs> I know, but you forgot to pause it in the middle, so it sounded really funny. Can do fee. Nope. Weird. 
that's not. I don't know. Let's try to see if I can get the moss off of it. Oh, oh okay. the Deku scrubs look a little <laughs> horrifying. Right. <laughs> oh, oh shit. Horizontal. Come on. There we go. Wait. Okay, this is gonna take oh, some time to get used to. Training in theory is cool, but when you actually gotta do it, it gets yeah. a little different. What? Oh shit. What? Oh. Master, I have information for you. I have the ability to offer information on items and create. Okay. Well, let's learn then. Okay. Uh, it's a holding <laughs> type. Okay. There you go. Target lock, Deku Baba. This violet plant is widespread in wooded areas. It will attempt to bite anything in the first Though it is covered in a tough outer husk of the inside of its mouth soft. I have confirmed the existence of two varieties. Those that open their mouth vertically and those that open their mouth horizontally. You have defeated two of this enemy type. I am unable to analyze your battle performance rating with this opponent to do insufficient data. Okay. okay. If we die to these guys, that's gonna be really silly. Really silly funny. Right. Squeagle moment for real. <laughs> yep. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's a familiar symbol on the door. Oh. Hi, Shiga. <laughs> oh, dear. I don't like how everything turned red for a second there. Hmm. I know, right? <laughs> oh boy. What the hell? Is it me? Squeagle, are you okay? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Fuck that! <clears throat> right? <clears throat> That's some pretty strong evil asshole energy down there. Now, I may be stupid, but I think this is the other half of the goddess temple up on the sky. Oh shit! <laughs> no, I got the. I can cut the grass, and I'll be fine. <laughs> yeah. I was incorrect. Ah, you don't know how to cut grass. Like I just bully you for like zero. Rude. <laughs> Nah, it's funny. It's funny to believe. I'm, I'm pretty like sure up at Skyloft is the other half is the Goddess Temple. I could be wrong. I'm gonna be doing a lot more studying in this game than I remember. I can promise you that at least. Give me. Well, while well, these doors appear to have been opened recently, they are now sealed shut by a powerful, unidentified force. Well, we know it's the Sheikah, that's for sure. Yep. <laughs> no money. Empty grass. Well, let's move on. Hmm. Okay, well, here's a thought, right? <clears throat> we have a magical sword, correct? Yep. So by all means... <laughs> oh, I thought that would work. What if we smack the door? <laughs> nope. Nope. Hmm. Let's see, what are our options here? Oh, let's go back up over here. Maybe I missed something. 
It has been- you can already tell how long it's been since I've played this game, considering. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. <sighs> well, you know what? Let's just- let's see what's down there. Ah, uh, yeah, the, the music ramping up. Yeah. Uh, of <laughs> destiny descended from the sky. Where is the soul with the goddess? Oh, I'm... Never mind. Goddess voice or something. <laughs> Your key is okay. Goddess voice, go ahead. <clears throat> oh. Probably, I think. I don't know. Raise the sword of the goddess Skyward. Take aim at the evil arm and unleash his power. I will seal you yet! Damn. <laughs> yeah, quiet down, toenail. <laughs> toenail? <laughs> Fucking toenail. <laughs> of course. So yeah, we basically have to told the thing to shut the fuck up. You know. Master Squeagle, I'm supposed to be changing the area that was triggered by your Skyward Sword. Oh, sorry, I have also detected an aura that correlates closely to your cell block. Hmm? I surmise this aura belongs to Zelda. I can lead you in the direction of this aura through the process known as dowsing. Would you like me to explain the process to you? No. No! It's shit! I hit the wrong one. Yes! <laughs> Sorry, picture of Zelda's face is great. What? <laughs> she's, she's assumedly in the temple. Okay. Good to know. <laughs> I like how you do the spinnies when going up. Right. Whee! This lands. <laughs> just start fucking Better, right? puking everywhere. <laughs> God, imagine. I like how you can walk up to an enemy like, Come here, I'm, I'm not gonna do anything to you, I swear to God. <laughs> right? This ain't readying the sword. Funny. Whee! <laughs> 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 Well, by yep. all means. <laughs> but it's locked. Or is it? Well. <clears throat> what else? See what's in there? Ooh, pretty. You're pretty. <laughs> hey, you can save now. <laughs> yep. That is one tall hat. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh, I shall pause. She's got Shika oh. tattoos on her face. I wonder who she the is. The traveler descended from the clouds above. I welcome you, child of fate. I wonder who this could be. I know it. Hmm. Yimpa, maybe, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Tell me, what is your name? Squeagle! Squeagle? Ah, Squeagle, good. Very good. Though, <laughs> since you have already gained control over the secret power that fills your sword with sky winds, points skyward, the skyward strike is your command. <laughs> it is proof that you are fit to bear the crypt lady carry, the goddess sword. I have sat here for many years waiting for you to arrive. Also, that I could fulfill my purpose as your guide. You stand under the roof of the sealed temple, a place built by the goddess in eternity ago. Your arrival here was first predestined many years ago. The spirit maiden you seek arrived here shortly after before you descended into this light and shower light. There was no doubting it. Damn it, we there. just missed her! <laughs> Shit. Damn it, Zelda. Why can't you just stay put, woman? <laughs> Yet all is not as it should be. The spirit of maiden has not meant to be explained in the manner she did. 
Oh, wait, where we get. Ah! I feel an evil power marking in the shadows. It moves to warp the destiny for you to our party. Mm -hmm. Squeagle? You are concerned for the spirit maiden and secret whereabouts, yes? That is understandable, but for now, you must focus on moving forward. That girl has her own purpose she must pursue, so do you. She set off for fair and woods to discover this destiny for herself, and you must follow. Show me your map. The X upon your mark, your map marks the path that will lead you to Farron Woods. You will travel. You will be traveling in an unfamiliar land. Many monsters have settled here, and the map may not provide guidance enough for your journey. And so, I will give you the power to create beacons. Beacons marking your map. A column of light will stand at that location. And will act as your waypoint from afar. Blah blah blah. blah. I'm not- I promise I wasn't playing that up. I have to be that <laughs> accurate. Nerd. <laughs> God. Oh, you cannot see it from where we are. <laughs> I'm sorry to guide you. Leave the temple to the front doors and see for yourself. When you no longer have a use for a beacon, you can move it from your map by grace of again. Use your beacon's well and you will never fear getting lost. Go now. You must head into Farron Woods and chase after the spirit maiden, the one you call Zelda. On your way out, take the contents of the treasure chest within this room, which you find there should prove useful to you. You know how long your hair has to be to be able to wrap it around your head that many times, and then into a circle like that? I know, right? Well, but being braided on top of that? Right? You are ready. <coughs> Leave through the door before you and head into the woods. It was your safe travel. Ah. Know that all the questions you have now will be answered in time. For now, Squeagle, go bravely. Well, I'm gonna break your furniture real quick. Hey! Oh! Oh! So, what you're telling me is we have two free bottles to start the game with. I guess, yeah. Oh boy! <laughs> Number one enemy of Link! The pottery! <laughs> okay. <laughs> the reason I'm going to Farron right away is because that's the proper place to sit. Because then we'll properly. Sorry, you were like, at the one I s as soon as I get to the surface. And now you're like, oh, it's Farron Woods. Yeah, that's but now we're, it's going to be the surface, surface, sure. surface, surface. Mm -hmm. That's why. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Sure. Mm -hmm. Stinky. <laughs> <laughs> You'll see what I mean. Sure. Mm hmm. I'll throw you real quick. Please tell me he can hear them like Yeah, I heard that. <laughs> Shut the frick up, stupid. It's that one right there, see? See the statue? Yeah. Oh my god, they sound idiotic! I love it! And alright. <laughs> <laughs> stupid dumbass. I think they're harassing a Goron too, hold on. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. Leave the Goron alone. Too. So they don't care about you. Oh. Out of the way! Scram! Thanks for jumping in there to rescue me, bud. <clears throat> Just two more of those red pests. I didn't expect to run into a pack of them in this peaceful forest. Same goes for you. Just the second time I bumped into one of your kind today, and I tell you, all sorts of weird things are going on here lately. I owe you big for taking care of those guys, so let me tell you something fascinating. <coughs> hey, bud, I'm Gorko of the Goron. I have certain research against your history of the words here. According to this ancient text, there's some kind of place above called the Isle of the Goddess, far up in the sky. Apparently, these old statues serve as landmarks to those traveling up to the sky. Or down. From the Isle of the If you find one, be sure to examine it. Keep tabs on the number of the landmarks. Fuck! 
Supposedly, the statue specialist has had to have the ability to activate all the other ones. The whole thing sounds a little crazy, I know, but for one, I believe it to be true. Otherwise, would all these statues be all over the place? <coughs> it's a real head scratcher, bud. Makes you want to know more, does it not? Nah. Ooh. Uh, that's so, bud. I was hoping to tell you more, but I guess I could wait. Aww. This is the reason why. I'm going to show you right now. <laughs> oh, oh. <baby. laughs> Whoa! <laughs> mm. What in the world just happened? Did you use some kind of magic? Oh. Said you reacted the moment you got near it, bud. How crazy is that? Makes that you. And this is where we end the episode. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Mm. Take care, oh, shit. <laughs> of course. Goro! Goro! What was that? Oh. The statue just reacted to you. What did you do? Come on! Don't make a big guy big. Like, oh, no! <laughs> Poor guy. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, like, for watching. Okay, like just ignore him. It's <laughs> like, I'm gonna go back to the again. Oh. Take care. And have a good one. Bye-bye! <laughs> Wiener sword! Wow! 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 Wow!